yeah, but I'm uh, glad to say I'm not going to be doing too much talking other than this introductory session and the close because I've got two of my colleagues also to help and they'll be running the sessions. So it's a big welcome to the summit. So this is our second year. So somebody said to me earlier, so it's now a tradition, is it? So I think the answer has to be yes. You know, it's great to, have, to see the people here, so that's, that gives us encouragement. And also very much uh, welcome to Auto World. Um, one of the speakers said to me, this is the speaker's gift. Can they choose a car when they go? So, uh, the other story is that when uh, we first came here, I said, can I bring the car up? Um, meaning, can I bring the car to unload the stand and stuff? And they thought I actually wanted to bring a car into the exhibition. <laughs> I can assure you, as much as I like my BMW, I don't think it would be quite right then. So. Anyhow, um, many of you I know do know Open Forum Europe, uh, some of you don't, but our mission in life is very much about open competitive choice for the ICT market. Uh, we're not for profit, we're very firmly independent and I hope very business oriented as well. Uh, openness is very much at the centre of what we're talking about and we make no qualms whatsoever in saying that openness is at the core of this conference, this summit. And that's the way it's going to be. Now, many of you I know seeing the faces were here last year. And I think the headline quote from last year was from Vin Cerf when he said, if it's not open, it's not the internet. And that was a very powerful, very simple statement of actually what really we think everything is about. It doesn't necessarily have to be defined in every detail. You know if you're open or not, and also you know if you're closed or not. Um, and so we can spend a lot of time worrying about some of that detail, but fundamentally we're talking about being open, allowing competitive choice, allowing substitutability. Um, we are about campaigning, we make no qualms about that also, but we are also hopefully about bringing new thinking into this agenda, uh, creating and facilitating thought leadership. So for us the summit is very much the start of the year, it's about bringing hopefully some of the best speakers from the world, getting their insights into the subjects and getting a healthy debate. So if this is not hopefully just a, a conference where you get a, a succession of speakers coming up, standing, speaking, and then going away again. We really want to encourage debate with the audience, not just with questions, but also the opportunity now for you to give your thoughts and views at the same time. So the, the format is we said we've got two sessions in the morning, uh, one, sorry, one in the morning, one in the afternoon, and I'll briefly go through those in a minute. If you look at the importance of what we're talking about, um, there's no, everybody understands the difficulties of the global financial problems at the moment. Everybody is looking for answers, not just in cutting costs, but actually what are the breakout strategies. For Europe in a global